All right, Bobby, your championship began by taking Phil Mickelson's spot, one of the last players, the last player to get into the field. Uh, how was your first U.S. Open experience as a whole? It was very cool. Obviously, playing with Steve Stricker at his home home state was amazing. I mean, the crowds were unbelievable. Uh, I was pretty nervous the first day. Today, I had a couple of bad kicks, and I got nervous again. But, you know, it's a great experience, and hopefully this boosts my confidence to go back on the web and play good. Yeah, how much can you build off of this, being in front of this type of galleries, this type of test that they've set up for you guys to bring that back to the web and, and then going forward hopefully onto the PGA Tour and, and WGC events? I think it's um, obviously it's going to be good. It's going to be rewarded with good play, I think. I think the, the courses on the web are completely different as what we just played. So I'm pretty confident about, about how the season is going to shape up. I am... Um, I hit it really nicely the last two days. I just didn't make any putts. You didn't find out that you were in the field until Thursday morning. Would you like to do this over, knowing you're in the field the whole time and, and just leaving the unknown out of the equation? No, I think it didn't change much. You know, I, um, I was ready either way. I was going to be ready if I was going to be in or out. So, no, I, I wouldn't do it any different. You know, I think... It's a good experience. I think I have to learn from it and move on. Thankful to Phil, I guess, that uh, he went to the graduation so you could do this. Thank you very much. Thanks, Phil. <laughs>